was a little luckier or unluckier than that because I showed up there and there was a gentleman whose name is Bal Lakshman Balraman, LB. Okay, he still lives in the city. Okay, and LB had returned from Michigan. He gave it to me and my friend, and he said, "Both you guys have to figure out how to uh, how to program this." And every day you report to me at the end of the day. So we sat down and we wrote. And this was really not assembler. Huh? The thing was basically machine language code. So you sat down on a, uh, sat down and you wrote down on paper all the instructions. Okay, based on the Intel manual. And then there were codes, 3E, 0F, D3, A2, all of that stuff. Okay. I still remember some of it, mm -hmm. okay? So uh, the Intel processor had A, B, C, D, E, H, L registers and all that. So we basically wrote all this code. And basically, we had our first programming experience with Assembler in that place. Mm -hmm. Okay, we, we left it. LB made us work instead of playing table tennis and eating in the canteen, <laughs> which my previous batch did. Okay, and so we went back to RDC Trichy, and when our final year project came, uh, me and Somshekar Babu decided that we are going to do a microprocessor. Pro By the time the college had bought a Z80 kit, Z80 oh. is the Zilog 80 processor, okay. which has the same instruction set as an Intel 8085. Okay, okay, very mm. much like what AMD and Intel are. Mm. So we wrote, we created a project. We are we are the first people to create a microprocessor project out of Arish Trichy. Everybody else was building some electronic system. We basically did this. So we had a element of programming. Mm -hmm. In fact, I was looking at my project report. There's all the code is in the in the back, right? And we got it to work and we demonstrated it to the examiner and all of that. So I knew programming. I knew assembly language programming. I land up in the U.S. Okay, and as Providence may have it, two years later, I got a job which still involved doing assembly language. I was, I'd become a systems guy, okay? Mm 